means the whole world is bonkers for baby bumps. But I'm not talking about reality stars, I'm talking about royalty. But have you ever wondered what you would buy the baby that has absolutely everything? Well, I've got a beautiful handmade keepsake box for those once in a lifetime memories. It's fit for royalty and perfect for your little prince or princess. I want my keepsake box to have a pearly sheen, so I'm giving the whole thing a base coat of flat white acrylic. As far as the box goes, you can work on pretty much anything you already have. Ones like these you'll find easily from the hardware or the craft store. And for the pearly paint, it's only subtle, but just by going over the top of the white, it gives it a really delicate luster. I'll set that aside, and while it's drying, I just want to cut down some of this moulding to add to the top of the box to give it more definition. Just using a cardboard box as a spray booth so I can hit the moulding with some gold spray and while I'm at it, some decorative scrolls as well. I could just stick the moulding on as is, it looks pretty good, but I really want to make it shine and give it an extra layer of luxury, so how about some gold leaf? Now this stuff is not too hard to apply, you just need some glue, sometimes known as size. Carefully lay over a sheet of the gold leaf, then using a dry soft brush, push it right down into all of those grooves and dust off any excess. Some PVA glue, I'm just going to run it along the back here and that will hold these securely in place. And then for these little scrolls, one goes on each side. Well it's looking pretty good so far, but for some sparkle around the lid, how about some of these stick-on diamantes? You can find them where they sell scrapbooking stuff. For the base, some of this beautiful decorative trim. And for the lid, just add a few little embellishments. This crown is perfect. For a sumptuous lining for the inside of the box, I'm using some of this gorgeous golden satin fabric. I'm just cutting it to size, then using some cardboard with some wadding on top. If you just wrap the satin over the cardboard and the wadding, you can just glue it onto the back. The base goes in first, followed by the sides. Well, the box is beautifully padded and lined. And for the final touch, let's make it really personal with some letters on the lid. These boxes are perfect for storing precious mementos and make a gift fit for the future king or queen or your own little prince or princess.